Good morning guys and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to talk about my May budget. So if you haven't already watched my last video you should because there's some things that are changing. Um, so let's just get into it. So my first paycheck for May is going to be a little bit more because I have four hours of overtime and work I'm working tomorrow for it. Um, I get to play the slime at work. That's pretty cool. Don't ask. Um, <laughs> I have a wedding I'm doing, and so that's $200. I'm going to try to do MTurk and Plasma for 50 and 70 hours, and then my old moving fund. So we are no longer moving as a collective group of four to a new house, so I don't need that down payment anymore um, for deposit. Everything here is pretty normal. Power will probably be less still, probably be 80 something, but I like to be prepared, so I just put 100 so I know. Groceries I put at 155, gas at 100 because it's been going up, even though I'm gone for five days. Hopefully that should be enough. This is all normal. Um, I did put $120 for miscellaneous slash Hawaii money just in case I need it for anything. Debt. This is a fun one. Um, these are all the same. Those are all normal. And then I'm paying down my ICCU account. Most of that moving fund is going into that. Um, and then that way I can get that paid down. If you want to know why I'm doing that one instead of my um, smallest student loan, watch my last video. I will kind of link it somewhere around here. So sinking funds. So I don't want that medical thing to happen again, so I'm going to put $10 away every month for medical, 20 for concerts because I have one coming up in June and August, $50 for a down payment, I already have 50 saved, and that's for a house. Like I said, if you're confused, um, watch my last video, I kind of explain it all in there. Um, I'm just going to slowly add to that, knock out more debt and then go full force on that down payment, so obviously that will change. Uh, cart maintenance, I don't have to pay for oil changes because I got the lifetime guarantee or whatever. Um, so that is just in case I don't have anything saved for cart maintenance. So I'm gonna start doing that. Gifts and holidays, it's May and my mom's birthday is in May, so I have $40 for that. And then my smallest collections is $97, so I'm going to try to take care of that in May as well. Not very much going on, but if I can get everything to stay how it is, I'm going to have 58% to debt, and that is with the sinking funds. So that is phenomenal if I can make that happen. So uh, stay tuned. Let me know how your May budget is projecting out if you've started it, if you haven't. And if you're new here, please subscribe. I hope you have a wonderful day, and I'll see you later. Bye.